Hi, I'm Laura, a patient navigator. During your consultation, your doctor had discussed about Limparza and Avastin care plan used for treating your cancer. I want to explain about this care plan in two short videos. In this video one, we will discuss what are the medications, how they work, and how they are administered. In video two, we will go over important side effects, when to call your doctor, and how to manage common side effects at home. What is Lenparza and Avastin Maintenance Therapy, and how does it work? Avastin, also called Bevacizumab, is a targeted therapy treatment. It is a monoclonal antibody that binds or attaches and inhibits or blocks growth factors that are important for new blood vessels to form, which can be one of the ways the cancer grows. Therefore, this can stop cancer cells' growth. Linparza, also called Olaparib, is a PARP inhibitor. It inhibits PARP, an enzyme which is involved in DNA repair and thus growth of cells. Limparza works by blocking cancer cells from repairing their damaged DNA. Who gets this regimen? Please note that this is a maintenance therapy. Maintenance therapy is used for those patients who have already had a response to initial therapy. This regimen is mainly given as a maintenance therapy to patients with ovarian, fallopian tube, or primary peritoneal cancer with advanced or stage 4 who achieved complete or partial response to first-line platinum-based carboplatin chemotherapy and whose cancer is associated with humologous recombination deficiency positive status defined by either a deleterious BRCA mutation or a genomic instability. This test is done on the tumor specimen. How is the regimen given? Bevacizumab or Avastin is given through an IV or infusion port. It is administered every three weeks. Each three weeks constitutes a cycle. Each session lasts for about 30 to 60 minutes. This is usually continued for one to two years of maintenance as long as it is tolerated well and there is no progression or regrowth of cancer. Olaparib or Limparza tablets are taken twice a day by mouth. This is continued for up to two years or until disease worsens or a patient experiences unacceptable side effects. The tablets can be taken with or without food and should be taken at around the same time every day. Please tell your doctor about any medicines you are taking, including vitamins, herbal supplements, and over-the-counter medications to make sure they won't interfere with your treatment. Feel free to watch this video as many times as you would like or email for the transcript to read. In video two, we will go over some of the common side effects from this treatment and how to manage them at home or by calling your doctor if there are serious side effects. If you have any additional questions, please call your doctor's office. Thank you and good luck.